Yo, what is going on, beautiful people? Hopefully, you guys are having a wonderful day, man. I went to the gym parking lot as usual. I want to go highlight you guys about these job applications, bro, asking you about your sexual preference, you know, like it matters. Like asking me if I like dudes or women on a job application is kind of crazy. Why are they asking this? The reason why I think they're asking this is because I feel like if you're gay, you'll have a, a higher chance of getting hired, right? Or at least getting interviewed. Like you'll get filtered if you're a straight man in certain instances compared to if you were a gay guy, they'll let you in. They'll give you a call back. They'll give you a shot. Now, how, why do I think this? I think this because they're asking it, right? And they no longer have the, you know, the diversity requirements for black people, for Mexicans, Hispanics. Those are gone now. They they threw, they tossed that out the window. So now it's all about LGBTQ. And, you know, those that work in corporations know how heavy they ride for the LGBT community. And I'm not hating, right? I love gay people. I love LGBT people. Not like that. But, you know, I got love for y'all too, man. You know what I'm saying? This is a pro do you channel. If that includes LGBTQ, then, you know, good on you, bro. It's none of my business what you do behind closed doors. But it's none of these companies' businesses either. Like, why y'all asking me that? So, you know, me, I was applying for a job that, uh, you know, in an industry that I was familiar with, but the role, I had no, I had no previous experience, right? So I kind of got some imposter syndrome about taking on this job. So I went ahead and I, I applied for, I applied for the job anyway, you know, and I put on the resume, I was gay. I identified as a gay person for five seconds, <laughs> you know, I, I had, uh, I had a, 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 uh, a gay experience for five seconds, you know, when it came to that paper, I was like, Hey, gotta do what you gotta do. Click. And then after I filled out the job applica application, I wasn't gay anymore. Uh, but yeah, man, they gave me an interview. I got the job and everything. They gave me an offer. I negotiated my offer. I'm telling you, bro, like they are definitely playing favorites when it comes to your sexual preference. And they've been doing this for a while, you know, and I'm not hating. I just think that like for you to include something that is irrelevant, you know, in the decision making on whether or not you're going to get an award, whether or not you're going to get a certain role, whether or not, you know, like they're they're really like playing favorites. I don't think it's fair. I don't think it should be included in the decision making. And I think it's included in the decision making because why ask it? You're asking it because it's a part of your, it's a part of your data. It's a part of your analytics. It's a part of, you know, the hiring process. It's got to be because if it wasn't important, if they weren't including it, they wouldn't ask it. Let me know what your thoughts are. You know, some people might be like, hey, yo, that's wrong. You know, you shouldn't be doing that. Hey man, look, I'm trying to get this paper. All right. It's irrelevant. I'm not here to take away opportunities from gay people, but they could do the same thing. You know what I'm saying? It's fair play. You can identify as a straight person. Don't hate the player, hate the game. And I play for keeps. Hope you guys have a good day. Like the video. Please subscribe to support the channel. Let me know what your thoughts are on them, including sexual preference on job applications. Me personally, I don't think they should, they should ask you if you're gay, if you're straight, what race you are, what your favorite car manufacturer is. They shouldn't be asking you any irrelevant question that has nothing to do with the job. You guys have a good day. I'm out. Peace.